Andrew Vioerman last updated 1410 the 28th of May 2018 Hagen Hopkins Getty Images J Ingham made his All Whites debut against Fiji and Wellington last March. Darian Trainer Getty Images J Ingham Center celebrates one of his three goals from Melbourne victory. Football goals and assists. You can almost imagine it as a mantra, not only for Jay Ingham, but all of the forwards and attacking midfielders in the All Whites squad for the Intercontinental Cup in India, which begins for them against Kenya on Sunday, 2.30 a.m. Menzi time. The Melbourne victory player has been called up for the second time, and will be looking to make one of the two wide spots in coach Fritz Schmid's attacking midfield trio his own, by delivering where it matters most. Jay was first called up last March, under Anthony Hudson, alongside his brother Dane, a defender. Dane went on to become a regular for the rest of Hudson's tenure, which ended last November, while Jay wasn't seen again, until now. Read more, asterisk Schmid seeks, bright people, asterisk 21st century all white asterisk US bright lights wow Durand the asterisk great opportunity, for all whites Schmid has given him a chance to show what he's got, and the 24 year old is eager to take it, full of confidence after an A-League campaign that ended with the victory winning the grand final three weeks ago. I'm just here to do what he says and try to impress and hopefully I get a few goals and assists because that's what I'm up there for, in that wing position, Jay said on Friday, during a training camp in Auckland. It's always good to have new mindset. It will be a good experience and we can't wait for India, you know? At least three tough games, they'll all be very, very good teams, and I have no doubt that with the team we have, we'll give them a good hit, add feedback, assist stats are hard to come by, but Jay has scored just three goals in 58 competitive appearances from Melbourne victory, though it's worth noting that in 40 of those, he came off the bench. However, even with that considered, he is still averaging 698 minutes per goal for them. Those selected for the Intercontinental Cup more than a dozen notable players are absent, for a variety of reasons, have only managed three international goals between them. They were scored by Maya Bevan, last year against the Solomon Islands, and Tim Payne, who netted a brace against the same opponents five years ago. Alas, the Solomon Islands did not receive an invite to India. With Costa Barbaras's Marco Rojas and Ryan Thomas contenders for those wide attacking midfield spots in a full-strength all-white squad, Jay and the others stepping in know they have to deliver if they are to return down the line. In any football team you're in, they always want goal scorers, Jay said, goals or assists, it doesn't worry me as long as we're winning and we have a good performance at the end of the day, because that's what we're here for, too. progress, with such a young squad that we have. It may be a young squad, with 15 players born 1996 or later, but at 24, turning 25 in August, Jay is the fourth oldest member, younger only than Justin Gulley, Tom Doyle, and Nico Boxall. His brother, Dane, is the second youngest, older only than schoolboy Lee Baratokakis, and Jay said it was great being in camp together. When you're together you're thinking very similar, with him being a right back and me being a right winger, even, on Friday, in training we just had a sense of where each other would be, and when to press and when not, and it's a great connection, and I'm loving being here with him, stuff. 